Let's hope there is no crocodile. <laughs> of course there is crocodile. She may have a more strap. I see. Tiger. That was a rhino. You see? We just spotted our first elephant. It's very close. It's getting serious. It's early in the morning and last night we decided randomly that we will take the walking safari here in Baidya National Park uh, today and uh, the sun is just rising and it's a beautiful time so we're just gonna have breakfast and we're gonna be walking through the jungle the whole day so I'm super excited Oh, our food arrived, the parota here Looks good. good. Thank that you. one as well. Uh, Nepalese tea chia. So it's alu parota, which is like a bread with potato inside, omelette, and yogurt. yogurt. How was the breakfast? Good. Normally, the tiger, rhino, elephant, and leopard seems dangerous, but they are not. They are really calm, but sometimes they may attack. Mm -hmm. Right, because when they have cops, when they are injured or full time, but mostly mm -hmm. like in this area, walking there, I, I understand or I recognize the almost all tigers. Mm -hmm. And for their during the territory with the top yeah. mark, I understand all individuals mm -hmm. from the, this walking zone. Then I know they are really healthy, they don't mm -hmm. really attack the humans, yeah. mm -hmm. right? But it might be, but we need to awake a lot, yeah. right? So especially walking safari make you so awake. Because mm. you open your all senses, yeah. because you connect with the ground, yeah. the tree, grass, everything is you make yeah. everything. That's mm -hmm. I love the walking because I love <laughs> connection. Right? Yeah. And when you go walking safari, if we encounter a tiger, how we react? We don't have to run. We have to face it because they feel that you are still strong for them. Mm. Because why the tiger did not attack human beings? Because we are the not natural prey species of tiger. Also, they feel surprised. They don't want to try the new because they are all yeah. the same like us. We always eat dalbat, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I want to eat different food, can be problem for us. Yes. Right? That's why you always eat dalbat. Same like they, they always eat deers, deers, like different types of deers and all the varieties, right? Yeah. And for the elephant, a rhino is most dangerous in park. Very dangerous. Then tiger. Tiger is planner hunter. If he sees something, he must see ten or twenty be minutes before yeah. to kill somebody. Mm. Because you have to make plan. Even if you are poor, if you want to want to kill somebody, that he have to make plan whom I have to eat. Then mm. he charge. Okay. Otherwise, not like an elephant rhino. Just boom. They mm. are really quick reacting. Like normally, elephant and rhino is more react, mm. more reactive, you know, mm. and fast anger than tiger. Yeah. Right. If we see like elephant, but things is that they are big animal. We can see from far distance and we can make a plan. Yeah. And what mm. to do? Like elephant, normally we don't. We have to run if they coming to charge. Mm. We yeah. throw something and run. If you throw something, means they will stop sometime. Then they get chances and our smell on it, and we get chances to go for mm. The rhino, <coughs> we must run or we must climb the tree. Even mm. the small trees, you know, you don't have to go big tree like this. But if you have the small trees around, <laughs> you just go eat and it's perfect. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. <laughs> well, I think if it's um, yeah. emergency, you will learn. It yeah. is emergency alarm. Mm -hmm. And also we have to cross the river very soon after of the park entrance. Mm. Then I think we have to cross multiple rivers today to go extreme part. Right? Yeah. Okay. okay. So. Ready? Perfect. Thank you. Are they crocodiles in the river? Yes, we have some crocodiles. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's do it. The sun is rising. Perfect time to start the hike. Baba, do you still get excited about the jungle walk? Sure, always. Always. Every day. And you still have the fear when you go inside? Of course. Yeah? Because fear means respect, you know? So we arrived to the entrance of the oh, Badia welcome, National Park. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Namaste. 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 <laughs> we entered the National Park and the permits are all done and it's time for Baba Extreme Safari. 
<laughs> Are the ch chances high to see Tiger today, Baba? Sure, 100%. 100%. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So he promised us to see Tiger, so... I think we arrived to our first river crossing and it looks like a proper river. So we have to get rid of some of our clothes and let's go. Let's hope there's no crocodile. Of course there is crocodile. <laughs> well, let's hope there's not here. <laughs> it's not so stable. Sometimes sand, mud, rocks. It's alright. It's not too bad. <laughs> now I understand why is Baba extreme suffering. Ah, I think I left my stick there. <laughs> I just realized I have to go back now. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> I did, I did halfway and I left my stick. Let's uh, give it another go. <laughs> I was already happy that, oh, I'm almost there. Oh, no. In the meantime, Uriel dropped her phone <laughs> in the river. But she was very lucky because she managed to find it. Yeah. I managed. She may have a more strap. I see. That was a rhino. You see? Just over there. Observing us. Yes. That's the Papa Extreme. Crazy experience, right? It was a bit scary. You are not sure. So yeah. yeah. And loud. Very huge. Baba just said he got information that there are gonna be some elephant and also that they saw tiger on the way. So we have a high chance to see tiger. We're gonna go up there. So it's a higher chance maybe to see something. It's beautiful up here. Nice view. still very young and now now we keep going to see tigers let's go to the jungle so mysterious you hear all the noises and makes you feel even more excited and we arrive to the next few Let me guess. Happy, happy, happy biscuit. biscuit. <laughs> this is a good one. Yeah, that's uh, something I need now. Spoon. <laughs> oh, oh, looks nice. The last container. Rice, rice. It's a decent portion. Yeah, there's a lot. You are safe now.
climbing up the tree to see if there's any animal around. So we stopped here and climbed up the tree. Um, Papa is just there on the top. I won't go that far. <laughs> no. um, we just found out that they are actually bullet ants. Don't know if you can see. They got the name because when they bite you it's uh, as painful as a gunshot. So I just don't want to experience it. Okay, there is an elephant coming. serious somewhere there inside right so you're safe okay oh, the tiger the tiger marks Tiger. Can be a tiger anywhere. Apparently the best time of the year to come here is around April and March because the grass is cut and it's very short, it's easy to see. Why do I come now? It's taller than me. It's insane. I can't see anything. Oh finally he got out of the grass. Here, then you can see all those views. All the views? Yeah, the river. 
and tiger is coming slowly to the water. Okay, it sounds good. <laughs> okay, so we have to climb this tree. We managed to climb up the tree. We were quite high. And the view is just amazing. Yeah, hoping to see tigers or some wild animals from the river. They're coming to drink here. And it's a perfect spot. Yuri also managed to come up. <laughs> How do you feel? You feel a bit scary? Yeah. So now we are part of the national park <laughs> and we are back to our roots, to our ancestors and we are back to the to the tree. <laughs> we climb back. Yeah. No, unfortunately so far we are not lucky so we will have a break to we have a mango juice. <laughs> well despite we climb the tree, seems like it's not our lucky time to see the tiger. But there's still a chance on the way back. We waited two hours on the trees but couldn't see. <laughs> <laughs> no. Unfortunately no. Well, it's a gamble. Which means that we have to come back. Yes, we have to come back. That's right. Oh, there is an Alexander parakeet. We just spotted it down the street. They are very beautiful. Yeah. A lot of spotted deer. Oh my god, it's a whole family. Are you ready? This time I have to carry my stick. Wait for me, I wait for crocodile. you. I don't want you to be eaten by crocodile. <laughs> yeah, you made it, girls. <laughs> Yuri, high five. <laughs> so finally we're back to the guest house. We had a good rest. Yeah. And uh, we really enjoyed this experience it was actually the highlight of our trip here in Bardia National Park and we can just highly recommend it uh, we haven't done the jeep safari we just did the walking but I think walking is the best yeah you can more connect to the nature yeah and, and you use all the senses yeah all the like senses sight, are sharp and hear and smell yeah it's incredible and you feel fear when you are in the jungle and you have to hide yeah yeah when the rhino came and or no the rhino was there and just started running and we were not sure he ran towards us or away but it was just a sudden uh, scary moment yeah and you get the adrenaline boost yeah. and it was amazing yeah and the owner baba he's super professional and mm. he's such a knowledgeable person even though there were some moments that it was very scary but at the same time we were we always felt safe around yeah. him yeah i just i just trust him yeah. so if you come to this national park i highly yeah. recommend you to come to wild planet uh, eco retreat yeah. they even have restaurants and they have hammocks and places to chill so Mm -hmm. You have an amazing experience, especially if you take one of the one of the safari or the treehouse. Treehouse was also an amazing experience, really sleeping in the wild. Yeah, it was fun. So overall, it was an amazing experience. So we yeah. didn't regret we came. Even we yeah. didn't see a tiger, mm. but we saw rhino, elephants, yeah. and beautiful birds, deer. Yeah. We are very grateful yeah. to be able to experience this and this environment and this thanks all to the locals who put a lot of effort into yeah. conservation yeah. and uh, also for the hospitality mm -hmm. yes they gave us it's incredible here all the nepalese people are so amazing this evening we are heading to pokhara by bus and we will continue our journey from there. So if you finish here this chapter in Bardia National Park and uh, thank you so thank much. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you. Tandebar. Tandebar. <laughs>